training is inherently difficult. If it was easy, you wouldn't learn anything. Well, we just did a, a movement from, uh, from the beginning of uh, the battle area to uh, the striker area zone. That difficulty can be magnified by throwing in another language. Bounding in between the Japanese and American forces uh, using uh, both their anti-tank and their tanks themselves, and then the American forces using our strikers. Specialist Clark, a 2nd Brigade soldier, was assigned to the 12th Japanese Ground Self-Defense Force as an RTO, or radio transmission operator, for a heavy weapons live fire training mission, which not only improved communications between the Japanese tank and U.S. striker platoons, but also allowed him to learn some things. I hope to bring back uh, the tactics that I see on the battlefield while we're out there, and uh, just some of the SOPs they have um, with communicating um, down the battlefield. From the Yakima Training Center, I'm Army Sergeant Justin Cool.